Guys who are currently watching a clip from our podcast, The Fellas, the full podcast is available exclusively on Spotify with video for free. So go ahead and follow us on Spotify. It actually helps us out more than you could imagine. This is an interesting theory. It's a Madeleine McCann one, Chip. You'll like this. Oh, hit me. Here we go. All right, this person says, and this is from a fan, by the way, because we put it out on our uh, Instagram for asking for some conspiracy theories. So we got (gasps) Madeleine McCann is buried under the church in Prior de Luz. I think that's how you pronounce Prior it. Prior de Luz, yeah, that's where she got taken. Yeah, that's yeah, that's where she originally was taken or lost or whatever. Basically, the parents became really close with the church as the new priest in a recently built church down the road. Heavy emphasis was on it in the documentary. Yeah, so like it's just you you can actually see where the church is in some of the photos, I think. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, they were given a, a key and full access to the church, which car park was being, um, the car park was being re-tarmacked at the time. So I believe they kept the body, uh, hence why there was no traces of her blood in their car and then buried it in the church. They might have done uh, a confession and told the priest who isn't allowed to reveal what is said in confession and out of sympathy allowed them to either do it or have access to the church and they took advantage why i don't know it just sounds like just is there it. any proof here there 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 was a person who had some weird device <laughs> okay that's a great start who had a weird device that finds missing people and gives coordinates but I can't remember his name and the church fell within the coordinates. Nah, but that those coordinates of like where she went missing in the first place. Like, I don't know. Um, I just think it's a really like, sounds like there, would be, there would have been more evidence about the church. Surely, like, yeah. Sounds like Japanese. Yeah, I'm thinking super Japanese. I feel like I've heard that one too before. Um, but yeah, it's not, it's not a great one at all. It's not looking it? good, bro. What do you think happened to her then? Bro, uh, I don't think, right, yo. I think she was kidnapped. I th- I think so as well. I think she was taken into a ring of some sort or like some dodgy guy was just, just iron up. Nuts. British. How? I don't think it was the parents. Like I'm, I'm, no. I, I just think it, people, bloke, um, people like the, yeah, I think it's Christian the German Christian Summer Brook, yeah. Brook, no, I've it's something like, like, like that. Yeah. Right, something like that. I think it was that guy, man. I, I watched a, a big thing about it. Mm. I just think people love the idea of it the being the parents. parents because everyone, look, we all, me and Chip love a conspiracy. Yeah. I love a conspiracy and it makes it way more interesting, like, interesting if the parents did do it. But really, there's not It's exactly that. Much. All it is, is that the parents were just uh, like really, they just, dealt with the whole thing really it, it, poorly it's exactly what it seems like i think like parents were out neglected the child yeah bad, extremely bad parenting yeah window's been Got left unlucky open. as window's well. been left open child kidnappers taking advantage of it maybe traffic, mean iron them up to them iron them up anyway operating in that area knit to kid boom that's it yeah they've obviously they've killed they've probably killed her she's most definitely de- dead yeah yeah there's I, zero way she could be alive like, well yeah. It's there's very, never zero. Very, there's never zero, but it is very yeah. low. Percentage with, I don't well. know, with social media and everything, like the amount of sightings we've had. No, yeah. no, no. But, no, but do, we, do we not remember? Uh, was it Joseph, Joseph Fritzl? Fritzl had an entire family in a basement yeah, yeah, so she for could, like 18 she years? She could be alive in like a basement, but I mean, they've, they've caught this guy already for doing shit. And like, Yeah, I think it's, it's about, him, I think. look, again, people will cling on to the parents theory because it's cooler, but... It, there's just not enough for me, at least, that points to the parents. There's like lots of little bits, but in any investigation, you can find a lot of little bits. Like, why, why did Cal go to the to to the shop only a day after someone died? Well, because I needed food supplies. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like, there's that. What did you see? What I mean, like people can frame things in weird ways to make the parents just look more guilty when it's maybe a bit of a normal thing to do. If if she was ever found, it, she would be like the biggest superstar on the planet. Mm. No, inter- uh, inter- maybe not super. No, no superstar su- is a bit of an odd term. Maybe no, okay, all right, superstar by she- superstar, I mean level of fame. Like she would be so fucking for about famous. six months. Mm. Nah, she'd be famous. I don't know, man. For a she, very long time, I think. She, Our be whole filmed. generation know who Madeline McCann yeah. is. Yeah, so for this generation, she would be extremely famous. Yeah. And then I guess it's up to this generation to pass down the story to the next and one. And our saying, parents, oh. like, lived, like, our parents were the ones who had to, like, go through all of that of, like, oh my God my kids like want yeah. them to be safe like every like, i was in yeah. portugal like a week after it happened and like i remember all mums were just shitting could themselves. have been you man could have been <laughs> really did you actually go to portugal yeah i remember it all in the paper and stuff whilst i was out there i'm yeah. surprised I, i'm actually surprised oh wait but you weren't in the same area no i was in villamora 
Ah, uh, a bit of a bougier spot. Yeah, come Chelsea on. Chelsea fan zone. A little, a little gated, gated, gated community. community. Yeah, you're a bit different, That's you well. Come on, come on, Bruce. Uh, yeah, no, that Madeline McCann one, that, that, that's my thoughts on it. People have asked us to go through like a proper mysteries one. We will do that as like a Eventually. special. But, um, it's a big case, you know. That'll be our biggest episode, yeah, yeah, and, and that Lots will also unwrap. take us hour. That yeah. will be like an hour long case. There's a lot to unwrap in that. It's a big, yeah. and big, who knows? big, big one. Maybe at the end of that, I might change my mind. But for now, yeah. it shan't be changed. Yeah, I so, think I'm that so panorama good. they made about it was the best bit of coverage that they've done. Do you think not about... the Netflix stuff? Was Netflix it the Netflix did, one? Netflix, Netflix one got one. Did Netflix, a lot of people didn't like that Netflix Yeah, a lot of people I said it was biased. I actually stopped watching it because I just thought it was shit. Really? Yeah, I actually didn't enjoy that one. I normally do like those things and I just... I remember what waiting hell? for it thinking it's going to slap. I just didn't enjoy it. I think I, I really liked it because uh, I hadn't fun. watched much before. I wasn't captivated. It. Yeah, I felt like everything I was watching, I, I knew. So. Yeah. Mm. Well, there you and go. I felt like I just didn't do a good job with do it. You, do you um, like much of the Netflix stuff they're putting out? It's all been shit recently. It Bro, let's, let's quickly talk about the Netflix real quick. Yeah. I just watched some of good off Netflix. No, you didn't. I swear to God, it's got like 90% on both critics and audience on Rotten Tomatoes. But you're not gonna like this. Uh, if it's uh, it's not an anime, shit. but it no, is. No, no, but it is. It's, it's, it's a superhero. It's a cartoon. Thing. No, it's not. It's a cartoon. Oh, I know what you're gonna say. It's called Sea Beast. Okay, no. Sea Beast or something like that. It's good. It Has it got anything to do with Marvel? No, no. It's about about pirates. Oh, see, I'm I'm interested now. It's pretty good. I watch it. I'll and, give that a go. And la one last thing, because I wanted to tell the viewers this and the listeners about this. I started watching a new show on Apple TV, called? and I'm fucking loving it. It's called For All Mankind. Okay. And it's a space show. And without revealing too much, it's about what would happen if the Soviets beat America to landing on the moon and it ignites a space race and they go and keep one up, one up in each other over the wait, next years. Wait, wait, sick. wait. That sounds it's, like a bit of me. Yeah, bro, it's a banger. 100%. It's got Joel Kinnaman in it. He's a fucking unreal actor. He's amazing. It's great. I'm okay. It. And what, what is it? There's, there's, back it are, are there any superpowers in this movie? No, it's full realism. Full like, real, that's what I'm it, here all, for. All it is, it's, it's full realistic. It's just an alternate reality. Like what would happen yeah, right. if that happened? I'm gonna watch that then. You have, you have I'm, I'm gonna watch that tonight. Cool. Amazing reviews too. Chip. I bust you there. I'm proud of Trust you there, me. brother. It's really it just good. feels nice to see you raving about something that just has a, <laughs> a little me. substance to Listen, it. Listen, I've been waiting a minute for something nice that's space related. And when yeah. I saw this scrolling through Apple TV, I canceled my subscription as well. And I re- Bought it just for this. Just for this. When, when are we doing a premiere of a film that we all want to see? Um, uh, Oppenheimer. So, yeah, Oppenheimer. Yeah, That's there's no way one. I'm getting no, invited No, 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 bro. One. I'm, I'm going to book out the whole fucking premiere for that. <laughs> no, we'll be sorry. Hans Zimmer will be asking me for a ticket. <laughs> we'll be we'll be chilling, don't we? Yeah. Um, but I wanted to talk about Netflix really quickly, yeah, though. Yeah, yeah. Um, because you said that was on Apple TV, but, but your Sea Beast was on Netflix. Netflix. yeah. But for the most part, Netflix is having a howler. Yeah, I'm hearing that they want to start implementing ads into a paid for service. We already pay. Yeah, we already paying a good amount as well. Yeah, good. it's like with YouTube. I'm pretty sure if you have YouTube Premium, you don't pay ads. Is Netflix? You okay. don't watch ads, sorry. With what you get with Netflix, even if some of the latest films haven't been up to scratch, let's go back a year and say we're in a good part of Netflix. Is it cheap? Is it are you get? I think you get more for your money. Like you're paying like max. Most people are not paying the max thing. You're probably paying a tenner a month. No, no, no. I, I swear to you, because like realistic, realistically, it's fifteen in it. Because I got the max one. I I think it's fifteen. But that's for, that's for uh, ultra four K. Nah. Like no, no, no. It's more than that now for Netflix ultra four K. Can we get uh, Netflix's really? price list up right yeah, now? Yeah, highest price maybe. Or just uh, like what their what their different up. tiers are. I thought the average was probably playing a tenner, but maybe not. No, it's more than that now. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And now they want to introduce ads like midway through watching a show. That was the whole reason why Netflix was sick. It is the lowest. And, and the highest is what? No, that is the highest. No, nah, man. That's yeah, the yeah, highest. Yeah. Dollars, dollars is $19.99. So no, no, no. But don't talk dollars because they finessed six, us It's about here. 16 quid for the highest, but which is, you know... If you've got a fucking 4K TV that can actually yeah. handle that kind of quality, then you probably can afford that. Um, but I think that Netflix is great value. I don't think so. So back in the day of DVDs, right, you'd be renting out a DVD, and if it was a new DVD or something, it's probably, it was, I think it could be somewhere between five to seven quid for like two nights, right? Yeah, but bro, things have moved on, man. Like, we've got to remember that. Yeah, but that. Now, now you're paying, let's say the average family's paying 
12 quid. Let's say 12 quid for Netflix. That's 12 quid for a lot. Like, yeah, you might have gone through the whole catalog, but they're pumping money to originals. Yeah, You've but got there, there's nothing. Like, there, there stuff, really like, there is... isn't that much good stuff yeah. anymore. There's a lot of um, casual stuff on it, though, like action movies like The Rock, um, Ryan <sighs> Reynolds, stuff that people who just put on Netflix and I go, oh, fucking watch that after work. There's a lot of that on there. I don't know. Well, what I'm saying is they've recent. I think they they've lost a ridiculous amount of users. Yeah, I think it was it something has. like two million users. Yeah, and a lot of people share passwords on Netflix. They're trying to stop that. Yeah, which but, is... but and they're also now trying to bring, like I said, bring in ads yeah, midway that, through watching. That's an you're just gonna your your whole business is gonna completely that's, crumble. That's, that's like hell. that's like when OnlyFans said they were gonna ban porn. Yeah, did do they you remember do that? that? No, nah, because then, so they were like, oh yeah, we need to ban porn because investors won't invest in us because we're a porn company, essentially. Yeah. Uh, and then all the in existing investors went, hold on a second, that's about 99% of our platform that Amen. you're going to get rid of. We're going to go broke. But yeah, Apple TV though. Apple TV, Making lately, a strong like, push. Loving it. I, I, I've, there's a few shows on yeah. there that are... Um, and now you're going to go watch another... I'm going to go and watch I, and, and even when I go on the homepage, the interface, fucking banger. Yeah. So much better. Do you want to know who's got the worst? It's Amazon Prime. So you, bad. Have you used the TV app? Do you Amazon really Prime? think it's yeah. that bad? Have you used the TV yeah, app? Yeah, it's yeah, very yeah. slow and it's very just like, it doesn't look like I'm browsing. Like, ah, just some, it really, really irks me, man. I don't mind it. I feel like it's a bit hard to navigate and find something good. Yeah. I think Amazon Prime, again, like, for that stuff to be included in your prime subscription, it like good. in terms of that's value, good. It's good value, that's why I think Netflix is just so far behind. But then again, like Apple TV is expensive too. Mm, yeah. Well, how yeah. much are you paying for Apple TV? I, don't, I swear I only paying like, am I not only paying like six quid or am I paying more? It might be. No, I know. Actually, you know what? I think I'm paying like 15 quid. Yeah. That's why I canceled it. It came up saying, your Apple subscription, 15 pounds came paying back. That. I was like, what? I've watched one TV series. Yeah. But uh, yeah. It's interesting, isn't it? very interesting but yeah we'll leave it there with you guys look we'll leave you with some uh some thoughts uh let us know will you be canceling your netflix subscription there you go. you've even all got a new show to go and watch now as well yeah you, well even... two new ones sea yeah. beast and uh for all mankind for all mankind there i'm also is. gonna start the boys the fact you haven't even started that yet is crazy. yeah well, no i know but yeah the best Definitely. show on tv right now the boys it's all fucking right. unreal guys if you haven't already, make sure you rate this podcast. Give us the big five stars on Spotify, of course. Yeah. Please check out our Reddit. That's where me and Chip, uh, we're, we're commenting in there all the time. We're actually in every day, so. So go ahead, uh, check that out. Proddy C is a, a local celeb on the subreddit, mm -hmm. r slash fellows podcast. You guys can check that out. Uh, and be sure to follow us on Instagram at the fellas insta. Obviously our TikTok as well, <laughs> fellas pod. And anything else you want to plug, Prodwood? Um... Please, guys, don't have sex with any family members. Yeah, don't, yeah, do, don't that. do that. And don't do just that. don't don't cheat as well. Yeah, don't do that. Don't do it. But don't have sex with your mother or your father. Don't do it. All right. Well, take it easy. <laughs> Bye, guys.